So previously on the channel I took a look at the Enac Fire E18 Apple AirPod like earbuds that come with the dock and those were really really nice they cost 50 pounds but today I have the newer version of those so this is the successor I believe from Enac Fire and these are called the Enac Fire Future so this these were sent in by the company themselves but I'm not being paid to uh, do this review because they call it the Enac Fire Future as you can see the design is much much better in my opinion they look um, a lot better, um, more futuristic. So this is the dock that you're looking at right over here. At the back, you still got a micro USB port for charging. So I wish they obviously would have gone with the um, USB Type-C, but I guess it doesn't hurt. Now on the front, uh, um, as far as the design goes, um, it's pretty smooth, but as you can see, it's got LEDs on the front, three of them. So go ahead and open it up. It's got three LEDs over here. And these indicate the battery life of the buds as well as the dock itself. Uh, when it's charging and yes it does charge the buds when it's charging itself as well so that's nice um so let's take a look at the buds over here now in my opinion these are a huge improvement over the e18s um let's go ahead and take them out i'll actually bring my phone over here and they connect with bluetooth there's no nfc we don't expect it from this kind of stuff so just go ahead and turn on bluetooth and then just pick um pick them both up and um, they should connect and obviously there's a voice um, inside the buds that tells you what's going on now in terms of comfort these are much 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 more better um, these are like really 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 comfortable for some reason and they look much better as well so as you can see the design on them is actually really really nice um, they do look a lot better And obviously to disconnect them you basically turn them off and then when you want to charge them you can uh, go ahead and put them back into the dock and it should start charging them so when you actually got this closed um, the two lights on the side actually turn on and they'll indicate which one is charging so it's just gonna do this for five seconds so that one is charging which is most of the time because I don't know what's wrong with it um, but Let's get to the biggest point of this video and that is the sound quality. Now the Enac Fire Future, in my opinion, sound really, really, really good. And I'm an audiophile. But um, when I did plug in the wired headphones on my headphone jack, they were actually blown away. But these are Bluetooth. Um, we're going to stick with the Bluetooth standard and the Bluetooth audio quality kind of stuff. Um, these sound really really good they really really well balanced the sound stage has is wide and i mean obviously the imaging is all over the place and stuff like that but the sound they remind me of the feo fh5s yeah i'm not joking they do because the mids and the bass is a lot like those the fh5s which cost um 240 pounds right over here um so these cost 50 so um that's really really good now let's get to the problem, the highs. Now just like with the E18s, the e 5 E18s, the previous ones that I took a look at, um, these have the same problem with the highs and that is that they kind of feel a bit clippy, they're a bit too sharp um, and it feels like it's clipping the audio a bit on the higher frequencies. I like to call this um, crippled highs because that's what they kind of sound like to me but honestly um, it's a really minor problem because the sound is freaking really really good um check these out in the comment i mean in the description i'll leave a link yes i do recommend these these are really comfortable they're much much better than the e18s and i'll go ahead and say it. these are my favorite bluetooth earbuds as of right now i don't care about the wires and all that just pick them up and start using them um it looks really really nice sorry for having it out of the video it's just really really good um the sound quality the the sound signature i actually mean um, it represents the Fio FH5, so it's quite nice. Yeah, I'll leave a link in the description. Go ahead and pick these up. Um, you, trust me, you're gonna like them. And yes, the design is much better of the talk to fit in your pocket. I like this.